I'm not making this up. Well, no one's suggesting that you are, Mr. Pintero. I saw the look on your face. Can I ask you a favor? Can, can I get a, a soda, a cola, something like that? Sure. Thank yeah. You. What is that look, Scully? I would have thought that after four years, you'd know exactly what that look was. Well, you don't believe in ghosts? You're saying that what this man saw was the victim's ghost? It sounds more like a disembodied soul. Which is just another name for a ghost, huh? Except according to Mr. Pintero, this one was trying to communicate. It was speaking to him as if she was trying to tell him something. So it sounds more like a, uh, a death omen. A death omen? Yeah. It's a spirit being that arrives as a harbinger of death. third reported sighting in as many weeks and as many murders. Each time the victim appearing near the crime scene trying to communicate, trying to say something. Communicate what? I don't know yet, but uh, thank you. If you hold on a second, I may have an answer for you. Hey, what are you doing? She is me. What? Written onto the wax. She is me. Look at this. Three victims. All women. All approximately the same age, height, weight, hair, and eye color. All attacked within the same six-block area of each other. Our FBI profiling model suggests a white male, late 20s, early 30s, his victims were probably strangers to him.